Welcome to this week's episode of Project Sullivan. I'm Gogo. And I'm Gilbert. What are we doing today, Gogo? On this week's episode, we are giving the Ford its first bath. Mm. After that, we're going to show you how just a few minor painting jobs can really dress up a truck. We're going to start with the headache rack. Or can it? Actually, yeah, we'll let you guys be the decision maker. We're also going to paint the bumper and the headlights and the grill. I hope you enjoyed this rainy episode of Project Sullivan. Rain, rain, go away, never come back ever again, please. All on this week's episode of Project Sullivan. Spider-Man today. There's a bunch of spiders under here. Hopefully one of them's radioactive. Do you know what time it is? It's time for one and run. Works 100% of the time, sometimes. The seat's got its expansion slot missing for your leg to fit better. Right here, the one and done didn't have enough power to get it over the hill, so we had to pop it in the four-wheel drive. On the plus side, we know the four-wheel drive works. Me and that buzzer had a little bit of a discussion, and we decided it couldn't buzz no more. <laughs> wow, look at that rust! Holy rust, Batman! I'm gonna miss that screw. And for the low price of $750, we can sell you our specially designed tool. Let's use the world's biggest hammer. Pull out my uh, wire stripper. I really hope my oil pan's over it. Drenched! Three. Two, three. Here's a better way to pull a drain pan on a transmission that doesn't get transmission fluid everywhere. Leave a comment in the comment below. Truck makeover on a budget. Under pressure.
Go, go. you might be surprised to discover that the headache rack has never been bolted on as long as we've owned this truck. With all our driving, with all our everything, I guess that makes removing the headache rack for paint that much easier. We need to get it to the paint booth and figure out mounting. Headache rack, prep for paint. Step one, remove rust, debris, and any flaking paint and use the wire brush to scuff it. Step two, clean with mineral spirits. we did we used isopropyl alcohol this time we're going with mineral spirits right so can we take this headache rack it's all rusted up turn it into a good headache rack well we're just gonna throw paint on it and see how it goes tell you this I'm already hating this expanded metal it looks nice but it's horrible to clean our cleaning rag of choice today couldn't afford microfiber, so we went with a budget and using old t-shirt we're gonna throw away. Don't worry, it's been washed. Hopefully it'll do. Truck makeover on a budget. I'm not a painter. I'll be the first to admit it. So if you have any suggestions that might make this better that I can do for cheaper, I'd love to hear it. Perfect time to paint. It's humid outside, it's about to rain, and you know, windy. So that's the perfect time to paint. Yes.
A few moments later. Let's continue this makeover by getting the grill ready for paint. We'll continue on the light hoods. And last, we'll knock out the bumper the same way we did the rest. So we've chosen to do this on a perfectly windy day. Again. Scar. But we're gonna get what we can done. Perfectly windy and humid day. Yeah, humid, no sun. Perfect day for painting. Uh, again, we're using mineral spirits to clean up. Behold, as this transforms before your eyes. We're just gonna tape off the logo. Take off these uh, light hoods right here. And the review. Ah, camera's falling. Let's see what the front end looked like before. Then we'll show you what it looks like now. Hope you enjoyed this week's episode of Project Sullivan. I really think the front end of this truck dressed up nicely. I hope we can do as well with the rest of the truck. Well... Join us next week when we try to keep dressing it up, and we're going to try to bedliner our running boards. Oh, oh, oh. Well, I remember how that went. It's a very interesting episode that you will not want to miss. If you've been watching this long, you might as well subscribe. And while you're down there, you might as well hit the like and comment something. Like, how was your day? See you next week on Project Sullivan. Nope, that was lame. Don't forget to return here for next week's episode of Project Sullivan. All this and much more on this week's episode of Project Sullivan. <laughs> Cut! I'm done with this. I'm out! <laughs>